Brakti Hawa Brakata, Yahu Shah, Brakti Hawa Brakata, Yahu Shah Bashem, Rakakwadash, double honor to the apostles, the elders. Salutations to you, sincere brothers, teaching and truth and in sincerity. Lesson will be entitled Six Figures Ain't Six Figures Anymore. Source CNBC, article entitled 65% of Americans earning 100000 or more are very concerned about inflation. New CNBC poll finds. Article published July 11th, 2022. Inflation is a real worry for, for many Americans, even those who earn six figures, and it's impacting decisions about how they spend their money. Fully 96% of those high earners are concerned about inflation, and 65% are very concerned. According to a morning consult CNBC poll, which last week surveyed 1,000 U.S. adults with an income of at least 100,000 a year. Psalm 64 and verse 5, they refer to the nobility of Edom. They control this entire system. These international bankers, beginning with the Rothschilds, which are so-called white people, based on the lineage of their fathers, encourage themselves in an evil matter, such as the New World Order, and <clears throat> an objective within the NWO is them ushering in a universal basic income promoted by inflation. They commune of land snares privily. Regarding this agenda, they do everything behind closed doors, right? Hence the term the Illuminati, all right? They move in secrecy. They say who shall see them and veil the spirit of Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah, all right? Hence the prophets and whistleblowers, they are being seen for who they truly are. They search out iniquities, such as this CNBC poll is an example of them searching out iniquities. They accomplish a diligent search. So, by them surveying 1,000 U.S. adults that made at least $100,000 a year, they found out that fully 96% of those high earners are concerned about inflation and 65% are very concerned. They accomplished a diligent search. Their findings, right, from their research. Both the inward thought of every one of them and the heart is deep. Literal. Psalm 34% said they are worse off financially this year than a year ago, and 46% have had to cut household spending due to inflation. The survey found if inflation gets worse, 38% plan to cut spending. Again, this is an example of them searching out iniquities and them accomplishing a diligent search regarding their findings from their research. It's definitely a wake-up call, said certified financial planner Shelley Yuka, a senior director at TIAA. They fear what it's going to do for them in their future. And how are we going to be able to manage our lifestyles if this is what costs are right now? They fear what it's going to do for them in their future. Ecclesiastes 12 and 3. In the day when the keepers of the house shall tremble, the keepers of the house right? Your economists. And what do they do? They watch the economy. And the strong men, meaning rich men, all right? Upper middle class. 
shall bow themselves and the grinders cease because they are few, meaning what? They will be humble because of no employment. And those that look out of the windows be darkened, meaning what? Hopelessness, depression, low mood, can't sleep at night. Because they are fearful what it's going to do for them in their future and how are we going to be able to manage our lifestyles if this is what costs are right now. Consumers have been paying higher prices on everything, including gas, food, and shelter over the past year, and it is costing households hundreds of dollars more a month and may the consumer price index, which measures Prices on consumer goods jumped 8.6% year over year, the highest increase since 1981. The latest report is set to be released on Wednesday. So, where Americans are cutting their spending in restaurants, 77%, entertainment, 69%, traveling, 63%. Big household purchases, 55%. Buying a new car, 45%. Media subscriptions, 41%. Gym memberships, 32%. Groceries, 23%. Non-emergency medical costs, 20%. When will inflation slow down? It's going to get much worse. Look and needs verse once. All right. And presently, <clears throat> this is what they're doing. Right. Where Americans are cutting their spending. Restaurants, entertainment and etc. However, groceries are a necessity. However, they are not spending as much on groceries. Why? Because they are attempting to preserve money. All right. Now, remember, six figures ain't six figures like it used to be. Right. Why? Because of the money being devalued. OK. And the middle class and the upper middle class is suffering. Proverbs 23, verse 5. Wilt you set your eyes on that which is not? For riches certainly make themselves wings. They fly away as an eagle toward heaven. And we can use the scripture for this lesson. All right, because now Americans, although they're making one hundred thousand dollars due to inflation, their purchasing power is gone because the dollar has been devalued. OK. And now you have to put major focus on the necessities such as car insurance your monthly car note, your house note, your house insurance, taxes on the house, expenses for kids, right? Gas money, groceries, the light bill, right? For riches certainly make themselves wings. They fly away as an eagle toward heaven. Soon as you get paid, you are broke again. 
All right. This is going to get much, much worse. Lord, will you edify Shalom?